Never fiddle with Joby John Abel's stuff. I am a young male around 26 years of age and am writing this warning in hopes it finds someone else. I was at the Abel residence and decided to fiddle with Joby John Abel's things. Looking back I don't see how I could have been so foolish as to do something so foolish like that. He found out and screamed out aloud, ear-shattering, terrifying scream. Jeff A. Rahaha, that scream, that's how I knew he was enraged and coming after me. I locked myself in his bathroom and he banged furiously on the door before he stopped, but only for a minute. For only a second I found myself believing the naive lie that I was safe from it until he let out a blood-curdling yell the words that he yelled out will forever haunt me, for the rest of my life which is of now, looks like it won't be too long. He screamed violently with an angry rasp to his childlike voice. What doing daddy? You gun die dad I I I I I I I could hear the sound of him slobbering. Knowing that soon the whole house would flood and I had to do something, and, quickly as time was running out. I tried climbing out the window, however I found my efforts futile as I am a redditor and decided it'll be best to try and fight this thing off. So I bottled up all my courage and broke the window in a last ditch effort to get out. With my newfound courage, I grabbed a shard of glass and stabbed it through the door getting a good stab in on him, knocking him to the ground. Quickly I opened the door, slamming it into his ugly face stopping him from slobbering and knocking him back to the ground. I went for a cut to the side of the face and ran. I stopped dead in my tracks when I heard a low growl from behind me saying hey you, you so stupid unlike me smart in my own way, you know know how stab I bet, turning around I saw him vilely rip a fresh collection of boogers from his nose. He shoved them down his fat, disgusting, greasy excuse for a maw. It seems that as soon as he swallowed them down his gullet, he healed fully and he got up. Quickly. I ran past him and locked myself in his parents room. I can see the slobber coming from under the door. So I end this knowing I will be dead and drowned in slobber soon.